What are you doing here? This is sacred ground. You should not be here. Well, either leave or tell me what you want. Who are you? Amistheos. I'm not here to start trouble, but if that's what you want, I'll end it. Your name? I'm Cassandra. Some called me the Eagle Bearer. I am Daphne, leader of the Daughters of Artemis. And you are maybe exactly who I've been looking for. And who would that be? A warrior, a hunter, one who straddles our world and the gods, one who will meet my challenge. When you put it like that, how could I not accept? There's a boar not too far from here. Kill it, then bring me its pelt. You want me to kill a pig? This is no ordinary boar. Let's see if you are worthy of my challenge. Kill it, and bring me the pelt. I'll be waiting, with your reward. will be well defended.
That's a big pig.
Did you get lost? Here. I killed your piggy for you. Hmm. You are skilled. Of that there is no doubt. I have plenty of talents. Of that you can be sure. Oh, is that so? Well, I look forward to putting them all to the test. Oh? And what did you have in mind? <laughs> Many things. But first, to business. There are beasts that roam this world, but are not fully of it. They've been placed here by the gods as trials, as tests. These beasts are creatures like any other. The world is full of mysteries, but not everything unexplained is ordained by the gods. Perhaps before this is over, you will have a different opinion. What exactly do you want me to do? I want you to prove your worth in the eyes of Artemis and hunt these creatures. I don't need to prove my worth to anyone. Just tell me what's the reward. With each pelt you return, I will grant you a boon from Artemis. If you are able to slay all the beasts, well, let's say your relationship with the daughters of Artemis will be forever changed. All right, I'll do it. Now, just how many of these animals are there? Artemis has laid out eight trials, and you have already started the journey. Hunt down those that remain. How will I recognize the creatures? Oh, you'll know. Bring the pelts to me. I'll await your return with my sisters, the daughters of Artemis. I hope you don't make me wait too long to see your face again. Slayer, I'm glad to see you. Daphne, I didn't think you would be. The path I set you on is fraught with danger. You could have been killed, or given up. No danger could have kept me from seeing you again. Maybe you're getting ahead of yourself. Maybe. I'll return when I have more pelts.
best stay out of sight.
something Amistheus can help you with, stranger? You would not believe the words that fall from men's mouths when they are drunk. The fools get drunk in your presence? I would not want to miss a second with you. Then perhaps we should spend some time together. But there is something I must take care of first. Maybe I can help you. The Athenian commander is one of my clients, and I know he would be very interested in what I heard last night. But those cursed Spartans guard the route to the Athenian camp. You want me to deliver it to the Athenian commander? Ah! Not only do you possess the strength of Heracles, but the wits of Hermes, too. I'm the one for the job. Then I can rest easy. May the gods guide you. Someone thought you might need this. Oh, thank you, Mystheos. Take this for your trouble.
Let's go. The mud men of Prometheus. If only Athena could breathe life into them. Κακόν προϊστήμιν. I don't know. Well, does it hurt like a bear biting you? Or a mouse? Like three mouses. No, like four. Ah, so a puppy bite size hurt. Got it. Will the hurt go away? Tell you what, you have to scare it away. If you roar like a lion, it'll run. Grr! <laughs> Good job. Now run along home. You must be a physician. Yes, I'm Lycaon. You must be a Mystheus. 
Are you here for treatment? Play acting instead of medicine. When I'm wounded, I prefer to see someone serious. The gods and the medicines they give us can do little when a patient has no hope. That's the best treatment I can give. You thought this through. You look strong and prepared for anything. My patients need mandrake herbs. There's a part of them growing by a little stream southeast of here. Are you too busy to pick them? Too chewy. A pack of wolves is resting near the stream. I'll pay you generously for your trouble. You know how to talk to Mistios. Is that all you want? The mandrake herbs? For now. Bring them back to me, and I'll pack at them for my patients. Then we'll see. I'll bring you the herbs. You said they were southeast of here. Yes, by a little stream northeast of Kira. The flowers haven't bloomed yet, but the leaves are a distinctive gray-green. Thank you. This must be the herbs Likaon wanted. Time to go back to the physician. Here, I found your herbs. Thank you. I'll prepare these for my patients. Could you please stay a while? I'll wait. I've crushed the herbs so they'll be easier to take. Could you please bring them to my patients? Just tell them they're for me, Likaon. I thought I brought you more herbs than this. I needed to save a double dose for my grandmother. I'll give it to her soon. Sure. I'll just deliver the rest, then. Thank you. All my patients are in and around the Horal of Delphi. One should be at the animal pens to the west. One is building a house in the northeastern corner. And, uh, one works in the fields to the south. Come back here when you're done. I'm sure I can find them. Legaon sends his regards. The medicine he promised. Thank you. Tell me, did he look well? 
He didn't look sick to me. I've seen him up and walking around at all hours mumbling to himself. He seems worried. I should bring him some sweets to cheer him up. I'm sure he'd appreciate that. These herbs are from Glicaon. Oh, thank you. That physician is so thoughtful and so handsome. It's too bad he's decided not to marry. Why not? He just told me some nonsense about not wanting to burden an innocent woman with his worries. Personally, I just wish he'd been honest and said I'm not his type. I wonder why he'd say that. Oh. Good day. Until next time. Likaon made this medicine for you. Thanks. See, I take care of these beasts, and Likaon takes care of me. Too bad nobody takes care of him, though. What do you mean? His parents died young. His grandmother raised him, but then... She was born under a cursed star. Never mind that. He's a good boy. I'm sure he is. I delivered all your medicine. Seems you have a lot of people concerned for your well-being. Thanks. Um... My grandmother, Praxithea... I have to bring her the last of the medicine. Will you come along with me to her house? I think I need your help. Yes. I'd like to know what's going on here. Oh, thank you. Please, my grandmother's house is this way. Thanks for coming with me. Why do you ask me that? If someone is impious to the point of doing grave injustice to people as well as the gods, do they not... What did Proxithea do? She spoke false prophecies for years. Those who came to her for advice are deceived only lies. Your grandmother was an oracle? Yes, upon the hill in Delphi. 
She confessed to me recently that she never had the gods, and only repeated the words she was told. Told by vile people with evil intentions. Exactly. Wars have been fought over those words. She can't be left unpunished. I... My family was torn apart by a false prophecy. If it was one of hers, I may take matters into my own hands. On. I know what you want to do. You'll just bring more shame on our family. I don't want to do this, Agavi. But for the sake of justice, we can't let Praxithea live. It's out of our hands anyway. Some strange men were searching the village today, looking for her. I brought them here, and they dragged her away. What kind of justice is that? You wouldn't understand. She was an impious old fool. Now we have nothing more to worry about. Who are you anyway? I'm Cassandra. I have also been wronged by a false prophecy. It might have been your grandmother's. If we don't find her, we can't settle any of this. Please help me figure out where she's been taken. I'll look for clues. What did you expect me to do? All that talk about killing? A solution showed up, so I took it. That wasn't the way it was supposed to happen. Praxithea must have lost this bracelet in the struggle. Not yours. But no ordinary thief would have left something so valuable behind. seen anything strange going on around here? Well, if bandits taking over my cousin's farm is strange, yes. What did they do? Gave her a running start. She can't go back there. They've set up camp, and they're armed and dangerous. Interesting. Where is that farm? It's not far west of here, but I wouldn't mess with those bandits. Thanks for the advice. This looks like a contract. Deliver the package to the drop-off and don't damage it. If they mean Likaon's grandmother, chances are she's alive. Praxithea was kidnapped and brought to a farm west of here. The bandits were hired to deliver her alive. Thank you for figuring that out, Cassandra. I'm no fool, Likaon. Your sister put Praxitea in great danger, and you've been asking me about killing. Do you want me to end her life? No. It has to be me. I need to kill her. You're no killer. I am. If she's done the harm you've said she has, then it sounds like you need my services. She's my responsibility. I don't want her to suffer. That's why I asked you for Mandrake. It's a painkiller. But for now, will you go to the farm to stop those bandits? I don't think I can take them all on myself. Let's go find Praxithea. Thanks, Cassandra. You said the farm was to the west. I'll meet you there. <laughs> Please, go ahead and free Praxithea. I'll join you later. Ella.
must be the former Praxitia is being held prisoner. be on high alert here. Thank you for saving me, dear child. Don't thank me, voice of Apollo. Or were those someone else's words you spoke? So you've met my grandson. You're right. I lied to everyone. I am so sorry. The gods should have killed me by now. Instead, they made me live with my remorse. Why did you spread lies? People trusted you. You were supposed to bring them the word of Apollo. I didn't plan to, not when I was chosen to be the Oracle of Apollo. But I met people there who told me I must speak the words they asked, or else my family would suffer for my disobedience. Family? Do you remember telling a Spartan family that their younger child must die? A grieving mother with eyes like mine. I am so sorry for what you have lost. Who wanted you kidnapped? These brutes didn't come up with the idea themselves. Please, don't ask me that. The ones who want to punish me now, the ones who told me what to say, they would bury you alive if I told you about them. The ones with masks and dark cloaks. The cult of Cosmos. Do not speak their name. Grandmother. Did she tell you? Is she the oracle who brought ruin on your family? I'm sorry for what I've done. I accept my punishment. But please, don't let my grandson kill me. Likaon's a good man, a healer. This would break him. No, this is my responsibility. I must be the one to end her. I've killed enough people to know that violence has no end. Better to move on and make the best of the lives the gods have given you. Move on? But you said Praxithea ruined your family. She can do no more harm. Killing her for revenge won't change what happened. Besides, didn't you tell me something about hope? Thank you for your mercy. I promise I will do good with what's left of my days. You're right, Cassandra. I might not be able to forgive my grandmother, not right away. But she can go on with her life, and I with mine. I think you've made the right decision, Ligaon. Oh, how do you do this? Decide who lives and who dies. How do you do it, Lycaon? All those lives depending on you, needing your healing and kindness. I, I... I think I need you, Cassandra. Not to kill anybody or find anything. Just to stay with me. I'm no healer, but I think you've been through a lot, Lycaon. You don't need a mistress in your life. Go back home. ...and be the physician you're meant to be.
Come on. Is there something you need? There is wild mandrake that grows out in one of my fields. A witch gathers it sometimes. I don't use the mandrake, so I don't mind. Well, I don't mind that part. What bothers you then? The witch dances when she collects the mandrake. It's, well, I suppose provocative is the word I want. I can't get the farmhands to do any work when she's around. Or my husband. That's a problem. But I'm not going to kill her for dancing. No, I just want the mandrake gone. Before my husband volunteers to start delivering it. And you'll pay me to deliver it to her? Yes, simple enough. It needs to arrive in one piece. I'll help you. You're doing good work. May the gods guide you. Delivery for you, from a farmer. Oh, just what I needed. Take this for your trouble, Mistyos. We have only the finest goods.
Given me my freedom, how can I ever repay you? I've been looking for you. I saw your message. What's happened? A crate of good wine was lost at sea. Pirates sank a merchant ship. I need that wine for tonight's banquet. You can probably still get it back, if you don't mind getting wet. Only someone truly brave would wade into those waters now. The pirates are still nearby, and I've heard the rumors of a shark spotted close to the port. You want me to destroy all the pirate ships? That's exactly it. Will you do it for me? I'm the one for the job. I mean your debt. May the gods guide you. Stay back! 
Anything you need help with today, healer? One of my patients has lost all favor with the gods. I need help lifting the curse that's been placed on her. Well, I might have some sway with the gods. The problem isn't the gods. It's with the person who laid the curse. So you want me to deal with her? Ah, <laughs> you understand quickly. All right, I'll do it. Thank you. You'll be well rewarded. You can leave everything to me. Where's my and I'll rip you apart? I've been looking for you. It's not a good thing. No one has to die here. What would it take to make you walk away? Maybe you could disappear another way. Like, aboard my ship? I'm to leave my family behind and sail with the mercenaries sent to kill me. So be it. That's it. Now to collect.
mercenary always brings home the... You're the one who left a message on the board. What's going on? A man in the city will not leave my friend in peace. She's infatuated, truly. He follows her, begs her. He sounds obsessed with her. Does she like that? Of course not. What started out as a silly crush has become something much worse. His words now make her think he will do her harm. You need me to deal with him. Exactly, my friend. You can count on me. Good. You're doing me a great service. You can leave everything to me. Your head's worth a lot! <laughs> <laughs> 
I'm a mercenary. If I was hired to find you, you know what comes next. The gods have decided my fate then. Time to get the reward. Has she been... taken care of, Mistyos? She is no longer a concern. Job well done, Mistyos. This is for you. Happy to help. Has he been dealt with, Mistios? He won't be bothering anyone anymore. We were fated to meet after all. Here, this is yours. That'll do. I should try to stay out of sight. You're the one who left a message on the board. What's going on? Our new leaders aren't taking care of those of us who were here before. They need to feel the wrath of our gods. I get results a lot faster than curses and gods. I've already cursed them, and now they're coming for me. So you want me to kill all the soldiers? Yes, all the Athenians must fall. I'll help you. Get this done quickly, Mistyos. I'll be back when everything's taken care of.
Let's go. Better pay me. You're back. Have you killed them? I took care of them. Every last one. The gods thank you, and so do I. Take this. Happy to help. Need help with something, friend? Rich strangers were to arrive at the port today, but those cursed pirates prevented their approach. Again. Is there a lack of rich clients on Dryland? Actually, yes. But even if the newcomers could make it into the port, the followers and bandits around here would surely deter them. So I should send them all to the underworld. All the bandits must die. Do we have an agreement? I'll take care of it. Good. You're doing me a great service. 
I'll be back when everything's taken care of. was worth it, Rahmi. Have you killed them? I took care of them. Every last one. You've set great things in motion. Take this as thanks. That'll do. Need something? It is time to honor the Onisos. Time to drink wine, Mistios. But there is much to prepare, and the ghosts will soon rise from the earth. Sure they will. I have to bring pitch to the farmer to paint his door with. It keeps the ghosts out. But game must be hunted, and goats must be slaughtered as well. So you want me to deliver it to the farmer? Exactly. It must arrive without a scratch.
I'll handle this. Glad we met, then. I should get going. <laughs> The hunter told me you'd be expecting this. Ah, just what I needed. Take this as payment. Welcome. Here, priestess. Anything I can help you with? I've just got word the Athenian leader is dead. It's the sign we need. The gods want us to drive the Athenians back. So you're asking me to send all the Athenians to the underworld? A few measly soldiers should be an easy mark for someone of your stature. I'll help you. You'll be doing divine work. Leave it to me.
You're back. Have you killed them? I took care of them. Every last one. The gods thank you, and so do I. Take this. Thank you. Anything a mercenary can do for you, stranger? I am to be tried, Mistios, charged with impiety. They say my teachings deny the will of the gods. If true, that is a serious offense. Our lives are guided by the irrational and the unknown, not the divine. My writings explain this wisdom. I fear with my impending trial that my work may not reach the person meant to transcribe it. You want me to deliver it? Yes, simple enough. It needs to arrive in one piece. All right, I'll do it. You'll be just what I need. We're done here. Ah, sin 
A sophist wanted you to have this. Thank you, Miss Thiers. Here, this is for you. Υπότιτλοι 